I'm Santosh Rao. I'm a medical oncologist, and I'm also the medical director of integrative oncology at University Hospitals Connor Whole Health in Cleveland, Ohio. I've had a lot of different roles within SIO, but I'm the current president-elect, and I will be president starting in 2023. SIO has been very important to me, both personally and professionally. I'll start with the personal standpoint. I think many of us who are in this field are like-minded. You know, we came into this because we have a certain belief that we can help uh, patients live better when diagnosed with cancer or after, that we wanna help empower people. And we believe in uh, self-agency. And so, you know, SIO gives us this ability to meet other people who feel the same way. And so I felt a connection with other people within SIO right away. And over the years, some of the most memorable experiences I've had at SIO was the networking and some of the fun that we've had. We've had amazing times at galas, going out. These are my friends. We call it a family and it really feels like that. And I really enjoy spending time with everybody every year, uh, just getting together like we're old friends and colleagues. I think from a professional standpoint, SIO has done so much for me in my career. It's given me an opportunity to uh, find mentors, which otherwise sometimes are hard to find. It's given me a place to have a, a role in the field of integrative oncology. And now that I'm more established within SIO, people at my work and uh, who know me professionally, they respect that role. They may not themselves be involved in the Society for Integrative Oncology, but they understand that this is an organization that is doing things that represents the field of integrative oncology, and they see me as part of an organization that's uh, well-respected. And, and in turn, I think it gives me more respect and opportunities to grow within the field. I think the Society for Integrative Oncology is a group of people who are passionate about improving the lives of people with cancer, who care about prevention and wellness as important outcomes, who give a voice to patients, and who are people who, who are like-minded and have fun. And I think we need to continue that. I think that it's important when you're doing something that's different to find people who think like you and who are um, res well respected. We have great mentors in this organization. That gives you courage, that gives you support, and it gives you colleagues that you may not find in your institution, but I have colleagues now all over the world.